you're in the Joyce Kilmer Memorial Forest. This is supposed to be a wilderness area. Although, I don't know many wilderness areas with paved roads, but... We are at the Joyce Kilmer Memorial Forest and it's a preservation part of the Natahalik National Forest um, by this guy named Joyce Kilmer who was a poet and a patriot and he decided that um, the Forest Service should preserve these trees, this primitive area, to the end of all time. And uh, there are some humongous trees that we're going to see if we can get up there and see. Um, we've got our gear today, so hopefully it'll be a good deal. Here's the trail. It's a figure eight, three miles. And... Um, It's 8 o'clock, so there's nobody here yet. Hit a whole bunch of people. He just thinks he owns this place. Somebody said go clockwise. That looks like counterclockwise, so let's go the other way. The world of so many mushrooms having so much to eat and decompose. <laughs> Along this trail, there are a lot of giants that have fallen. It'd be interesting to know how old they are. But they are big. And they are beautiful trees. It'd be just as interesting to know how long it'll take for them to turn back into dirt with the ants and the fungus and all the little bugs and creatures that eat them. But there are some beautiful giants in this forest. Great big tall long trees. It's just incredible. That tree right there, let me show you that tree. It's a very narrow, narrow trail <laughs> and a very steep fall with a really nice waterfalls down there. I love hiking through rhododendron tunnels. <laughs> Great big old trees covered with moss. They'll fall soon, but not soon in our lifetime probably. When I first saw these steps going down the hill, I thought they were bricks. <laughs> it's, it's just logs with saw marks in them. Somebody's really good with a chainsaw. 
This is a beautiful trail. It's a, it's a little covered up in raspberry bushes for vegetation on either side, but um, <laughs> you want to go that way? He wants to go the high ground. <laughs> We're following this stream, which has a whole bunch of beautiful waterfalls, but I can't show them to you on the camera because I have to look through bushes and the camera focuses on the bushes. So you can't see the waterfalls except for this white mass in the back. But what a beautiful area. What a beautiful hike. One tree or two. <laughs> There's another one behind me there. And I gotta tell you that these are not unique. There must be well over a hundred of these massive trees in this forest. It's a kind of a little footprint on the side of a hill. Maybe the loggers just couldn't get here or the too steep to get the equipment into. It comes through a pretty hard little river valley, I guess, but it's pretty amazing. If you go to church on Sunday, you're not as close to God as I am right here. This is God's country, God's creation. These trees have been here way over 300 years. They're big and they're beautiful. Have you ever wondered why those two-man hand saws were so huge? <laughs> this is why. The original trees in this nation were humongous. Can you believe, can you imagine coming to the new world and finding these humongous trees all over the east? You know, they, they totally deforested most of Europe, except for a few places where the kings maintain the forest for deer hunting. But these are incredible trees. These are the giants. And this is the best right here. We're going down the, I don't know what side, this would be the, if we started at six o'clock on the figure eight trails, this is the nine o'clock side. I don't know if it's really the east or not. But it's uh, much rockier and steeper, and I was warned that this was the better way to go down than up. So we did, and it seems to be a smart idea. Get a drink. Did you get a drink? Ugh. I think Akil and I might decide to go lay in that pool of water right there. <laughs> uh, well, this is the end of the trail. We are back at the back at the parking lot in the bathrooms. And we are glad we did that hike. That was a phenomenally great hike. Come on you, get in the car. Come here. And the parking lot has grown. So that's the end of our hike through the Joyce Kilmer Wilderness Forest, Research Forest, whatever it's called. It's a beautiful place if you can make it here. It's, uh, it's really nice. And uh, if you like the video, subscribe. We'll be back with another video in a few days. Hope to see you on the video. Bye-bye. <laughs>